Welcome back, everybody, to D2M's Hitman Contracts with Suyoi. That's me. And Ray, which is me. So, so back in the guy. slaughterhouse. No, you're already in a Meat Man outfit. I'm the Meat Man. You need to stop trying to kill all the innocents, but it is your run. But do you want to be sneaky on this run? Yes. Obviously. Okay, then I'll try to guide you. But you're doing good right I'm now. I'm pretending to be a piece of meat. Right now, you're. <laughs> Right now, you're just in the meat factory part. You're not even at the party part where I'm all the guys... I'm not seeing secret packages or anything. What do you mean secret packages? Oh, yeah. oh, hey, we left you an assassin package. Oh, well, that's probably the point of interest then. Either way, funny thing. Can I run? Now, funny thing here. I'm trying to remember where it is, so yeah, go back to where you came from when we last left yeah, off the can episode. Can I put things in here to, like, hide evidence? No. Okay. Go back to the place where you are just at a minute ago, like when you started. Is it raining up above? Look up. Oh, it's a reflection on the window. That's cool. I didn't That's notice really that before. Beautiful, actually. That's really cool. I didn't know that detail before. That's the lighting going through. What the hell is this? This is the meat thing. Oh, uh, I, I can do it. I guess. Fuck you. you. This will cause cause a distraction, I guess, to make people come up here. But there's something around here. I'm trying to remember. Oh, it's behind that box. I believe it's behind that box. Well, he can't see me behind this box. Dang it. Okay. I could get his outfit and drag him behind the box. You could, but there's too many witnesses here. They won't see. No, they'll notice. Okay, what? What's behind the box? Where is it? Okay, the, the basically put it quickly, somewhere around this room is supposed to be a hidden R93 sniper rifle, mm. which is a highly advanced sniper rifle compared to the one that you saw in the first mission. What the hell? I don't know why it's here, but it's hidden, and I don't remember don't where it is. They don't seem to care. Oh, it's between the boxes down here. Like, try walking between those boxes over there. These? Yeah, it should be hidden around here somewhere. Am I thinking of the wrong box? I remember it was up next to one of these. Ray, your, your faulty advice is really scaring me. It's been a while. I probably wouldn't check around all of them anyway if I was trying to find it again. It, you can get it in a later mission, but it's the earliest it can be found that I know of. I'm not finding like, it over here. Like, it's pretty hidden, so I can't remember exactly where it is. It could be I'm thinking about the wrong box. You might be. I know it's in this mission, oh, though. Oh, I can also turn it on and off here. Because it's hard to leave the mission with it. <laughs> right. What is that? Is that stairs? Yes, it is. That's what those represent. So am I allowed up, or am I only allowed in here? You're allowed to go up. Well, I guess it's safer to say there's nobody up here who would normally try to stop you, except for one guy, but he's not par part the of the normal party. No. It's somebody else who's not a target, but you can kill him if you want to. I'd say he deserves it. The meat man? No. Somebody else that's not a target, Damn, I said. Is that a mirror? Wait. That's not a mirror. That's the way you came through. There's a window, though. That's the entrance you watch from, but you turned left as soon as you went in. Oh. But you can go up the stairs, and I would suggest it. There's a particular objective up there. Oh, that yeah. Means... You haven't tried looking through all the map, have you? Well, uh, I mean, what about this stuff? That's, that's where the main party is. That's the main party. Square's Legend, so check that out real quick. Okay. Hitman. Hold on. <laughs> like, he's not even player. <laughs> yeah, that's right. It's still active, but nobody should bother you. Okay, so Hitman, Civilian, Enemy, Target, VIP, that's usually a superfluous, it's practically civilian, it's just like, keep an eye. Animal, I forgot about that, there are some animals, animals in here. Animals, huh? Do what? they have suspicion? No, they'll just attack you, because they're animals. Okay, so these are all enemies. Yeah. Wait, Targets. So what's with the red one, then? That's the target. That's so one, that's Meat Man? That's one of the two targets, no, that's the lawyer. Right, because Meat Man can't move. He's too fat to move. He's literally just sitting down on a bed. Oh somewhere. god, he's coming this way! No, he's going to the restroom. Don't worry. Oh, so I should kill him in the he restroom. He has a guard with him, and the guard won't let you go into the restroom. He'll shoot you otherwise, because he'll be like, no, nobody in there with him at the same time. No, oh, Like, can't. it's super safety. Like, they check all the stalls, even, is how drastic What if I could take his guard down? Yeah, if you could, but they stay closed. So, that That's one's... him? No, no, he's beyond that door. But try checking your map by pressing X. Go into your map. Map. Press X. Floors. I did bring it up last time because I forgot, because it wasn't important yet. You're not going to look at the second floor? Outside? Uh, outside? You were outside before, but you're right under that portion over there. See the enemy upstairs and the point of interest? Ah. You need to get to that point of interest. So then you go upstairs? Yes. So I should just go up there. Yes, but be careful. I forget. Is that the guy? I, mm, I forget what the path of this enemy is. Okay. He's not moving. He's not moving yet, but he goes between the point of interest and that window. Is he the guy that will kill me? I believe. Okay, you could wait right outside this hallway and take a look at the keyhole if he's about to move. He will try to kill you. He is a very much more enemy combatant than the guards are. I don't see him. He's not in this room. He's in the other one. See? Oh. Okay, so it doesn't seem to be moving yet. It might be safer. So he'll to go to my right and up to the point of interest. Yes. It might be safer to wait for him to go into that point of interest room and then kill him there. Will he stay in it? You can knock him out if you want to, though. He will stay in it. 
Oh, but like, oh, wait. Wait, what was your question? Will he stay in that room? He stays in there for a while. Okay, take a look through the keyhole. Are you sure you want to open this door? Yes. Ooh. But your man, well, ain't no pants on. So I should go take him out? Yes. I would suggest getting the fiber wire or the syringe, because those that, those will actually knock him out or kill I'm him. I'm only L2. Why yeah. am I not crouching? Because you're in the sneak mode. You can't be heard. I would suggest choosing a better weapon. That won't. That's like you whack at him, and it takes more than one. A weirdo. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The hell is this? It smells nice. I found a girl. Jesus. Some of her. Enough for a positive ID. Was it Stark? His brother. But I assume the mission hasn't changed. Oh, I had me, uh, data on that, apparently. So I gotta kill him anyway, even though it wasn't him. Well, her, she's dead now, and it's responsible from him Possibly? Having, kidnapping her. Yeah, this guy. Well, just because he has his henchman brother kill her doesn't mean it's not his no, fault. We don't know it wasn't it was him. We just know this is this guy, and he's got a shrine, so he was into it. So as far as we know, this is the guilty party. Yes, but, but she oh was god, still, he's still alive. Oh god, that doesn't look right. Look at his arms. Yeah, I know. <laughs> well, you know what? I broke both his arms. I think we can leave him. He's not going to be killing anybody ever again. The story is supposed to go is that Sturrock had this girl be kidnapped from a guy, probably to get back at him, and now she's dead instead. We find that out somehow. Oh gosh, look, look at the reflection. That's really good detail. I like that. Yes, it's Colin putting the same model but putting it under the floor to where we can visually see it. But uh, reflected and with the lightning flashes and everything. I know. It's That's a lot so of good. it's a lot of detail put in. And look, she looks like a clown actually from that uh, from that angle. Yes, but it's uh, she got gouged out eyes and blood all of her blood on the floor. I've never seen a good detail of this face man here. He's kind of creepy. Yes, he is. But I broke both his arms, he's fine. He's going around having a good time with this dead body of a girl he likes. That he killed. Apparently. Will, will she jump scare me? No, she's dead. Spooky. But you have her arm now, so that's cool. Nice, can I use it? No, you can look at it. Murder proof. No, I can use it. Okay, just don't drop it. I can't, uh, I, I can't, like, whale people with it? No. It's funny how many times you can move and hold and pick up, but you can't actually... Maybe just drop the arm somewhere. Standard butcher tool. So I can, I can I, wield this. I don't think that could be used for stealth killing. It could be, but I don't remember. There are, like, kitchen knives that are, like, you know, come up and slit the throat. I could try. So, you could save again if you'd like to. And okay. then we could take down the Stockman. I mean, Sturk. Sturkman. You mean the Meat Man? Yes. Who, as I was regaling Suya it's meat with... Man meat. As I, was, as I was regaling Suya with off-camera about, but then you told me to save for the video. I said, save I should regale video. it here. Regale it here. Yeah. So, Meat Man was one of the first characters shown in the Hitman 2 commercial. And I thought, what's with the really morbidly obese 47? And then I realized he just looks kind of similar-ish somehow. <laughs> and so... Kind of like, the same head shape. I found that it's not a deal. I just like the idea that, like, you know, I was like, oh, here's Hitman 3. He got depressed and became morbidly obese since yeah. the last game. <laughs> I throw a great powder! <laughs> powder! <laughs> I, if we actually talked like Bender from Fat Times, that'd be funny. Yeah, I was gonna funny. make that joke. Oh man, okay, so I. Am I wearing his outfit now? Oh no, I can't wear no pants. <laughs> yeah. Damn. I don't want to see 47's ass. Are you sure? I think, I think there actually is one time where he can wear boxers, and that's the closest we get to no clothes. No clothes, Agent 47. Oh, that guy left. So, being this guy down down the, in the party would be kind of weird. Actually, right? the guy on the bottom right just is a guard for the outside window there. Like, he's just outside that door. Are you talking like a, a gunman guard? Guard, yeah, gunman guard. I could take his outfit. You could, but it's safer to go around in this, because no guards are going to be suspicious of you being a guard. Really? You're just the meat man who, there's no other ones that, around the party, and you're pretty but safe. If I'm a guard, I can walk to the Mr. Stark, or the lawyer. Mm. Go downstairs. It's fine. I mean, it's going to be hard to sneak up right behind Okay, but him. if I want to get the lawyer, I have to be a guard. Mm, pretty sure that guard keeps out other people because of safety. Unless I kill that guard. Yeah. That is a weird position you're taking. What the <laughs> hell? <laughs> He's looking at us. <laughs> I think there's a good way to get the lawyer man, but I forget exactly yeah, how. Yeah, I feel like you're trying going to make me wing that part. No, I'm not going to make you wing it. There's supposed to be a way, but I'm trying to remember. Like, he goes with this guard and he leaves the one place he comes from, but I feel like there's something at that place that he's at, but I can't remember what it is right so now. No one's gonna be even slight- well, I've noticed that no one's even gotten slightly suspicious of me as a meat man. 
Yeah, not really. I mean, you haven't ran. You're not out of the ordinary. You just like you know, like, I've been right next to people. They don't care. You want to go through that door, actually. Oh, okay. Yeah, you should try to remember what the map looks like when you look at it, because you keep going past a lot of doors. <laughs> It's like, hey, you guys having a good time? Go away, we're busy. <laughs> Just <laughs> Can I get out on this action? No! I want in on this. Please Give it to leave. me. We're having a great time without you. <laughs> okay, I'll just... I do like that they're unmovable. It just looks... Boing, 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 boing. boing. It's like, yeah, that, that unmovableness. X marks the boob. <laughs> You're barely animating over here. I'm not. That's the fun. Okay, that's a kitchen right there. It's a kitchen right there. This is a kitchen. Oh, wait, I just remember what's in here. Doodly doo. Okay. Disguise change activates. Why don't we see? Well, why don't we see? I mean, it really should tell I, you. I don't want to like you know, make sure someone's coming yeah, in. Really yeah, yeah. Even Looks... though I'm a meat man, changing into another suit. No, you're a waiter. Oh, yeah. he's waiting his opium pipe. Okay. You can go and walk I'm right. I'm a waiter. In. Oh, you found the exit. So is that being a waiter help? It can because you're a waiter. Okay. I believe you need to be a meat man costume to actually get to Sturk, though. Thinking about it. Well, Maybe. I can take out the lawyer, though, but he's waiting for an opium pipe. Well, you gotta go get an opium pipe, then. Where am I gonna get that? Well, I guess you have to go to the party where all the stuff is. Can't have a party without a bar, can you? I guess not. I'm late for my job. Let me run in here. We're not quite in the don't crunk music area yet. That's another room over. Ah, this seems but, to be it. Well, it's more stronger than the actual big party room. Oh, Jester it's... Mask is a little suspicious. Is he? Don't go in there. All right, why? Because you don't have his opium pipe yet. Oh. Is that the opium pipe place? Only one opium waiter is allowed. That guy. Did you just swing at me? That's the other waiter guy. You're not supposed to be in here. Okay, so... You're not supposed... There's only supposed to be one in here at a time, so don't go in here when there's two of them. Oh, so I should leave? Yes. You're just standing around... Yeah, see? The other waiter's getting suspicious because there's only supposed to be one. Sorry. You're still within his eyesight. Okay. Okay, so that's one way to get okay, to Okay, so where is the opium? It should be at the bar. Wait, what is this? That's the door you just came out of. Who is this? That's the guy sending the food to the fat man. Oh. So I could take him and get his meat. You could. Okay, so this is the opium. That's where the bar is, yes. But I gotta wait till that guy leaves. Yes. What's he look like? Is he the red thing? The target, you mean? Okay, so which one is he? Are you talking about the target of the waiter? Talking about the waiter, the guy that I'm waiting to make leave. Well, it's not this guy, because that's what the red target is. Could I could kill him. I guess he's waiting for an opium pipe. Whoa. <laughs> I guess I could kill him, right? You could. You didn't huh? see shit. He heard you walking, though. If you go into silent mode, though, he won't hear you sneaking up behind him. But then he'll that other guy will hear me uh, strangling. Actually, no. They don't hear people getting strangled normally. So am I good now? You should be. He's over there not looking at you. You can talk to him. Yes, what do you want? Man, they're loud in here. The boss's girls. They pass right out, don't they? Yeah, yeah, it's true. One sniff to the pipe and... They're gone. It's opium. It's good shit. Hmm. Then I better serve them. They look so tired. So take a pipe and go wait for him in his room. Don't. Oh. Well, too much for that. No! <laughs> oh, I, I was wondering I why you just pull that. out a weapon. I didn't mean to do it. Then reload your safe. Oh no, I you pulled out a meat hook. You saved after killing the one dude. I also have this meat hook. Oh shit, he's got a meat hook. That's not allowed here. Like, if I went to a party, I just like picked up a meat hook that was just hanging on a plate on a shelf somewhere. Would everyone just freak their shit thinking I was gonna murder everybody? Probably. Can't trust nobody at a getting hot party. Yeah, I guess not. <laughs> Alright, so we're back up here. Well, get the Dang. meat hook and go to town now. <laughs> Dank memes. I think the fat man is much easier to get to than the lawyer, actually. Okay, fine. How do I get the meat? Oh, I was just saying that. How do I get the meat? Go to the kitchen. This isn't the kitchen. I don't know what the kitchen is. This is a lot. Well, it went. It was past the uh, room where you found the uh, waiter outfit. 
You mean outside? No. Like, going through the doors. All of them! See? You're like right in front of the kitchen. Well, you can knock this guy out. Then there will only be one waiter. So this? Yes. Give me meat! Give me meat! Huh. Should be a chicken in here somewhere. That's weird. If I pick that up, you're gonna be angry at me, aren't you? Even though I should be wielding this. Go see if you can't... Oh, wait, I think you... No, wait, because that meat man was delivering the meat to the man. See if you can't pick up a chicken by itself. I tried. Like, go hover around it? I no? did. Okay. So much for that. It's meat cleaver. Hmm. Can I have, like, meat? Sir, can I have meat? Might be because they're already delivering it? I don't know. Okay, so you can go try to knock out the waiter. He's probably already done in the restroom, though. You mean this? Oh, he went to the dressing room, I think. But this is the restroom, so... Huh, he's talking to somebody in there. Where? In the room above you, that's where the dressing room was. The lockers. All oh, the lockers! But what's he doing? Oh, he's having a dance party with the lady. So that'd be your alternative chance to have the opium waiter not be around. But you can okay, try to steal this. this while they're not looking, which is actually kind of a funny thing to do. But now he's suspicious and they're leaving. You ruined their fun, Sue. Like, come on. It's fine. <laughs> He's freaking out, man. Because I was just running. Yeah. You're not going to kill the waiter, are you? Maybe. I don't think I've ever seen that before. Hold on, I just got to duck down. Okay, so there's no one, there's someone behind me, but I could kill him now. Yeah. Don't you have a syringe? Did oh. you use the only one you had? Right. Yeah, you did. I keep switching over to, the, like, the uh, fiber wire, <clears throat> but, like, then it just makes me default to meat hook for some reason. Oh, look, the food's back on the table. Kidding me? Yeah, it's right there, see? Hey! Oh, you weren't a waiter. My bad. Can't come in because you're restricted from the kitchen, which is weird Fine, because the, the other opium. waiter watched through the kitchen! Uh, yeah. <laughs> Fuck it, I'm getting opium. You don't have to talk to him every time. So, is he waiting? So, see if he's in the room behind you directly. Like, over there. Yeah, the guard's there, so go in. Go in? Yeah, the room that had the guard. That one. This one? Yes. There he is. Saw. Place opium pipe. Should I kill him? Actually, is there nobody else in the room? Oh, hold on, wait. <laughs> I thought he was asleep. I was like, wait, you can kill him now. Uh, here comes the opium waiter. Uh-oh. Hi there. Uh, don't mind me. Go hide somewhere. Go hide. <laughs> Hey, wait, you already have an opium pipe. Well, that's impossible. You can't have more than one. <laughs> You're not hiding good enough. He's going to see on the way out. You're not hiding at all. <laughs> there was more room to hide in. Whatever. <laughs> I'll just go back in. Yeah, just keep an eye on the map to see where that guy's going. He'll be leaving the room. He's now coming he's coming in here to serve other people. So I'll just go back in there and kill him. Yep. You should be able to use a silenced pistol and nobody will hear you. Except if they do, but that would suck. Well, he'll get up, won't he? Oh, wait, they took all your guns. Okay, use a knife. I don't know. <laughs> now pick up his VIT and uh, VIP invitation. Oh, he's too far away to do that now. You knocked him over. Uh-oh. Did I fuck up the whole game? No. I just don't remember what the VIP invitation's for. So it may not be necessary? Probably not. I'm just trying to think, what the hell was that for? Alright, so you can just run back now. Nobody's gonna care. So hey. I should go back to my waiter outfit? I mean, my, uh... Meat man outfit. Meat man outfit. waiter for the meat man. Okay, meat that, man. Worked, that worked out somehow. Yeah. Well, like I said, this game's a bit more forgiving compared to the other one if you're trying to do something a certain way. Yeah, I'm a meat man. Probably get sound assassin for this since you don't get no much suspicion, yes. I should learn how to English better. What's English? And what is? Oh, that's the meat man! Oh no, he's got the Turka. Can I follow him? Yeah, you can. Just go in with? I'm not sure. I never tried this. Oh, it's just saving real quick. Oh, yeah. 
no need not to do that after getting to a certain point. There are missions that are going to be quite long-ish to even get to the target that you want to save along the Okay, so I'm a meat man. That's nice. Yes. It's like the milkman, but grosser. <laughs> he serves you bottle of meat <laughs> on every doorstep. Are you, like, freaked out by me or something? Yeah, the people get mildly suspicious if you just walk behind them like that. If You, get you know, someone wants behind me. Okay, you know what? I'm a very paranoid individual, so that's... True. It's just funny, because lots of people walk behind other people, and then they're like, no, nah, I'm okay. I'm sorry, I'm getting distracted. Yeah, I know. It's weird looking. It's hot. Once you get in here, you hear the real music, though, with the burr, 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 burr. Yeah. Only one meat man allowed at one time. I do like the color of the dance party area. It's very blue and nice. I like blue. It's just it's a is nice shade. dead? No. Ah, here you go. See, now it's getting crazy. Yeah, he is. Or he's unconscious. He's, there's, he's sleeping. I can take his clothes if no one cared. It is funny that you can take his clothes. I didn't expect that. Well, it's a party, so is oh, that really that Oh, here we go. We got cage ladies up above and party down below. It's cage ladies? Yeah, if you look up. See, right there. Can I dance? No. I can't get down? No. I can't get funky? No. I like how blinding that light is. I like how even he's doing things, I think. Well, he's just swapping around. He's checking him, but I don't think you're actually going to be able to get up here without the meat. Got it. Try seeing if you can, but he might tell you go away. Sono privato. Donore. Yeah, you're going to have to come back with the meat. Alright, so much of that. So we're going to have to wait a little bit. Might have to cut into that later. Yeah. Okay, so we'll cut back to when Suyo gets the kitchen meat. I guard the guy. I'm a meat man. Give me the meat. Okay, well, we'll cut. Oh. Oh, wait, uh, well, okay, I thought I had to take that plate. Either way, we'll cut back to when the meat's here. See you in a bit. <laughs> Man, what the hell is this game anymore? What is animating? <laughs> I'll just slide around like a damn Lego character. All right, we're back, everybody. Oh, hold on. He's got to prepare the chicken. He's got to prepare the chicken, everybody. Let him prepare the chicken. Hold on. And then he's going to try and take it, though, isn't he? No, he'll probably ask you to do it, because last time there was two cooks in here, and they were like, hey. Hey, but Don. He'll probably actually ask you to take it. And if not, just try to steal it right now. Ah. Uh. He's going to. He's going to. What's he doing? Okay, he's going to put chicken on the plate. Oh, very, he's going to put chicken on the plate. It's a very oh, get ready. It's a gradual process. Okay, he's not... Is he going to put it down on that side of the table? Yes, he is. Alright, pick it up. Hey, you! <laughs> hey, <this needs> to <laughs> Just kill the kid. Where would he like it, sir? Where would he like it, sir? <laughs> Stupid English. Upstairs. In the room. Go, go, go. Some of the voice editing in here is a little funny. Stupid but English. Not, That's why I talk to you in English. This chicken looks bad enough to be stuffed. So, go out. And put something in it. Make sure you drop all of your bad stuff, except for what you would need to use as a melee weapon, because you don't have guns. Okay, but, uh, so where am I taking this? You have to take it upstairs to Sturrock, like the same area but that you went to. But it says it's, like, big enough to be stuffed, like I put okay. something in it. Go, it, put go shit in it. hide somewhere, ammo. close the door. I don't know why there's ammo in here. Go into your menu, select a melee weapon of choice. Uh-huh, I'll take butcher knife. Okay. My cleaver. Do it. Now, go and choose the chicken. Uh, Equipped it? Equip it. Okay, press square then. Okay, I'm trying to remember how you're supposed to put stuff in the chicken. That looks like I'm doing it. No, because you're just putting it away. He'll actually put it in the chicken. Hmm. Oh. Place, Place meat hook. Yeah, there you go. You have to drop it first. My bad. Ooh! You have to drop Ooh! Could I put the arm in there? No! I was hoping I could make him eat the arm. I know, but I told you no. Wait, is he gonna eat the cleaver? No. And there you go. Now you need to drop your other weapons, because the guard will know that they're there. If they find any weapons on you that could be used to kill the dude, then they'll be like, ah! Uh. Oh, you have a random severed arm, that's fine. <laughs> yes, exactly. 
Uh, they no. also don't care about fiber wire or all this other high-tech sure? crap. Yes, it's undetectable. See, it does not trick them out. So, detectors. it doesn't matter to you that I have night vision goggles and binoculars. None of them use metal. They're all made out of polycarbonate. I don't know what that is, I just used a word. So, is it okay that I have... Wait, you can kill them with these lockpicks. Alright, now you're gonna need to... Did I just switch my weapon? Yes, you can do it at any time. So I didn't mean to. to. I know. You just got to put it up before we end this episode right now. Bye, everybody. No. <laughs> you can't fiber wire the fat man. Right. They have to be standing to do that. He'll never move. Alright. Equip the meat cleaver. You have to do it this way. <laughs> okay. Yeah, step all over that chicken. <laughs> Alright. Now, make sure that you're pressing the right thing. Okay. I have to be very deliberate about this. Yes, just for the doors because you don't want to press X randomly for no reason. You want to do it when there's doors. I'm aware I got meat out of the way! Finally, we can finish the mission. Oh no, not the mission! I have meat out of my way. If I pull this meat cleaver out at the wrong time, I'm going to die. Yeah, you probably will. But you're almost safe to get out of here. Hello. I like how the information says, hold on! Like, you, it's, you have a choice to move, but it stops you. It actually takes away control for a moment. Okay, touch my ass. Yeah, yeah, oh, really go oh, in there. Yeah, touch, touch. Feel in the crevices. Alright, you can go on. Okay. Oh, is it just a quick save in case something goes horribly, horribly wrong? Yeah, yeah, obviously. <laughs> I'm hoping nothing does. Oh, it is. But <laughs> you managed to somehow accidentally do something one way or another a lot. I mean, accidentally pulling out weapon, I can understand. Everybody does that once in a while. Push the wrong button. It's like, oops, I meant to hit X, but I pushed square, and now I have a gun, and everybody hates me. Nice place. There is a morbidly obese man with his ladies. Go over and press that red button real quick. Really? Yes. What's he gonna do? Close the window. Full purpose. He was talking, saying like, "Go out, give me." Hold on, give me a second. Give it a second. Come on, let's have our dad. He's gonna say something. I'm waiting for it. Just give me that food. Now! <laughs> it's fat bastard! Come yeah. On. Here, I'm gonna give him the chicken. There you go. Wait, if I give him the chicken, I'll lose my weapon, won't I? Yes. Give it to him. Is he gonna eat my cleaver? Lovely, lovely. Hold on. Lovely, lovely bird. Is that alright if I stand and watch? Yeah. <laughs> God, so gross. No, piss off. Alrighty. Pick up your meat cleaver. Uh, I gotta go return the plate? No, go Where's pick up plate? your meat cleaver. Where's you were plate? right next to it, go pick up the meat cleaver. Where's the plate? You're holding it. It said, oh. Pick up meat cleaver. Did you not see it? Well, now they're back. Good job, you wasted all your time. Reload. <laughs> I said pick up your meat cleaver, and it now said, go get him a new chicken, damn it! How about you do what I just told you, and go load your game? You had the chance to kill him, and you didn't. Load your game! There's no reason to do this! <laughs> load your the game! <laughs> Why won't you do it? Why are you making I'm this- I'm doing what the game said, Ray! Ray, uh, yeah, but guess what Ray says? He knows how this works. If you picked up the meat cleaver, you could have sliced his face, and then you would have been done. Now you're repeating I'm this serving, for no reason! I am serving my customer, Ray! How are you gonna get him more chicken? How are you gonna get more chicken? It said return the plate! Well, how are you gonna get more chicken? It looks like nothing's Boom. working. Boom! Boom! Do it! Pick it up, food slave! Yeah? Yeah? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yeah! You're about to eat your shit, Ray! <laughs> There's no reason to even do this. You literally threw away a chance and friggin' did deciding not to reload it for no reason. Ray, I am doing what the game said! I gotta follow its instructions to the damn T! Actually, no. It, the game told you to hold on, but you squirmed around all over the place. I let him pat my ass. Because I was being a gentleman. You said, it said hold on, you did not fall to a T. You squirmed well, all over the place. I said hold on, I didn't move because I couldn't. <laughs> well, it only let you not move then. You can move after that if you yeah, want to. Yeah, once it said let me feel your flesh, I let him feel my flesh. It's such a massive waste of time and I don't know why you're doing it. Pull out my gun. <laughs> if only you had a gun. Oh, right. <laughs> if I had the, could I have somehow placed the gun in the chicken? No. Could I have snuck in one of those other doors? No. Oh, no, no, I couldn't have. No, there's only one entrance to the building. Well, pick up your chicken plate. 
and pick up another meat cleaver to uh, put in the weapon, even though you don't need to. Cause no, the meat look, look, it says retrieve weapon. That doesn't make sense. The meat cleaver's still in his room. I think that this chef has something out for the guy, and he put another weapon in there. <laughs> See, if we didn't follow the instructions, we wouldn't know that there was actually a secret conspiracy to kill this guy. Just saying, after he ate the chicken, the meat cleaver fell out. He didn't care. You could have picked it up and killed him, and now we would have been I done. I like how he didn't care. We, we would have been done. You just decided no. No, we gotta extend this, even though it's going longer than it should. I was doing what the game told me, Ray. Well, sometimes you don't need to. Whoa, whoa, that low polygon shitty dancing is kind of scary. Well, that's actually the regular polygons for all the NPCs. I mean, the frame rate, sorry. I, I okay, I, I didn't see the frame rate change. I like how he can't see the dancers outside, he doesn't even give a shit. Now the music's really weird, you've been here for too long. The curtain's still drawn, so don't bother. It's me again. How many chickens do you eat in one day, you fat fuck? Clearly a lot, since he's been served one every ten minutes. His leg's twitching pretty bad. He's supposed to be dancing. Oh, is he? See, he's patting his foot. Now. Just give me that and I'll feed now, but the audio is so loud. Or right, retrieve weapon. Can I kill him while he's eating? Yes, but you didn't retrieve your weapon. Now pick up Meat Cleaver since it's still here. Congratulations, he's dead. Was that so hard, Suyoi? Yes. Put away your dang fire bar. People will get scared. Now you can leave. And they won't care that he's dead because he looks like he's Why were they angry. looking at the curtain? Because they'd be watching through the window, but then you draw the curtain, and then they don't see what happens. Basically, all three of them, where are you going? This is not the exit. Oh, he's gonna look at me. Yeah. I was gonna take that guard's clothes. No, that's not a guard, that's a that's a sleeping guy. I was gonna take his clothes. Well, he's gonna see you do it. You know, there might actually be an exit over here, I forget. There's normally not a need to come over here. Hi. This is where the guys rest. The guys gotta rest sometime. Check your map and see if there is an exit to the outside from here. Should be one of the back end of the whole place. Got this fancy sleeping area. I actually forgot this was up here because it's not, not there's nothing up here from what I remember. Just a very fancy area. And a surgery chair. Uh didn't notice that before. Mmm. There is no exit out here, and that guard's watching you. Bastard leave! You can leave the mission, by the way. I want to leave in a gimp mask. Well, oh, you have wait, to wait a while before he leaves. No, it's not gonna work. He's not gonna leave. He'll look at this different ways. What's he, this? That's the point of interest, which is where Skirt Sturrock was. Oh, but he's dead, so it doesn't. Yeah, matter. that was the point of interest. Him being so, killed. So what about that door? Try going through it. Huh. You're outside in the rain. In the roof. Hop on one of the trucks. And just ride off. Yep. Free Willy. No. <laughs> I think you need to get down there and try to use the truck. There you go. You have a cheese sound assassin. You have a micro Uzi. Oh my god, it's like finger sized? No. Oh, micro Uzi? No, they're just kind of small, like a handgun size. That's what a normal Uzi size like. Exactly. No, Uzis are bigger than handguns. Have you seen them? They're like large. No. They're like the size of your forearm for like the top part oh, of the gun. Oh, they're like one of those big. So they're like half the size of that, so they're oh. micro. But then you have micro Uzi, so that's two. Well, I guess that's it for that episode. No, we gotta see the next mission opener. Well, I did really good, apparently. Let's see how you did overall. With your 30-minute time limit mission, <laughs> that didn't need to take 30 minutes. Eat me! I mean, it could have taken, like, 20, but no, you decided it needs to take 30. It did not take 10 more minutes to wait for it to, to go all the way back there put a chicken on the plate. Actually, yes, it did. I counted. I am a big man who does things like this. <laughs> Why couldn't I... Oh, man, could I have just put that syringe in that... Uh, in that turkey and have him eat it. The Bajarkov bomb. The Bajarkov bomb. Hey, one of my silver ballers is missing. Because the picture was zoomed. Back to Agent 30, 47's bad day. <laughs> 37. He's the he's the other clone. He's he the get out of the bathroom, then he fainted over next to the door. He's like, oh man. Man. The curtain. Sure is blowy. Meth, not even once. Who's there? Uh oh. Satan? I don't want any! <laughs> oh, not snow again. No, not Russia again. I have to play Mission from the Last Game ever at this. Because I hated the last game. I said I loved it. You technically played a mission from the first game. I did? Yes. Going backwards through the asylum, it's basically the same land as the PC game's last level. There are some similar-ish missions. Well, at least the AI is a lot better in this. You were right. 
That's you were right, Ray. Must be Bianco's face. Folks is probably off the plane already. Gotta be quick. His brain is just reeling going through things that yeah. he did. Okay, so I got off the plane. The getting off this plane won't be as easy as getting on. He is talking, it's just no subtitles for some reason. Biggity biggity Russia! Bears on unicycles. Uh, actually, getting off the plane is really easy. I've seen uh, Nathan Drake do it really easily. You just jump off. Okay, You'll be but fine. we're gonna have to see about how we do this mission next time. Yeah! See, See you later. later, everybody. Don't waste a save on this. Well, you can just, just choose it for mission select. Oh. And by continuing the game. Okay. Wait, did it not let you save between missions? I don't remember. Okay, you did, because I remembered. Okay, see you next time. Bye. See ya.